I'ma test this out. Keep in mind that I'm an artist. Sensitive about my shit. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It is Charity Sunny, and I am back with another video. Um, I'm cutting my hair off again. Yeah, I'm doing it. Um. I tried to let it grow a little bit, you know, I had a little TWA, right? It was long enough to be that, right? Or was I just still bald head Sally? However, I'm cutting it off again because I told y'all that, brain part, hello, <laughs> that I wasn't going to grow my hair back out into, until I got to a point where I felt like I could take care of it consistently. And right now, I just don't feel like that. Like... I don't really want to feel like having to maintain length right now and so I'm gonna go ahead and cut it and I figured that out I don't know oh my god happy new year <sighs> happy new year it is literally it's January 3rd happy freaking new year <sighs> it is 2023 how do we feel how do we feel we're going into the new year? Yes, yeah, perfect timing. Let's cut it all back off. Okay, let's shed it. Shed the dead weight. Shed it. It's barely there. I'm even. I'm scared for y'all to even see what I got up under here because I haven't picked it out in a few days. That's why I don't need it right there because I, I can't even pick it out consistently. You need to pick your hair out. I'm ashamed. Let's just... Let's just, I'm going to pick it out and then I'm going to come back. I just don't want y'all to see what I got up under here. Because I know it's just pressed down and shaking over. I can't do it. So, just give me a moment and I'll be back, okay? Yes, ma'am. Yes. Oh, shoot. Honestly, this is very therapeutic. <laughs> this is very therapeutic, like, honestly. I will keep forgot how to cut my hair, oh my god. Oh wow. She's literally back. Why am I happy to see her again? Like, I missed her. I think, see, in this reaction is everything. The fact that, like, even this length just makes me so freaking happy. Shut off the dead weight, sis. And not even dead weight, but, like, if you're not feeling it, just go for it. Just freaking go for it. I feel great. Yeah, this just proves that having hair right now is just not for me, <laughs> for my mental health, because I just feel happy, I feel jolly all of a sudden. I feel great, I feel good. I'm feeling good rubbing on my head. I can't believe I cut, I did not mean to cut that side so low, but it'll be okay. Got my handy dandy. Can y'all guess what I'm about to do? I'm gonna pop this. Yeah, you heard it right. I'm about to put all that right up in there. I'm just about to go on in with it. Why? Because. I'm not. I really hate, like doing anything neat nowadays because I just want to do this and get it over with oh my god get it over with no but after this go round not this go round but after like when I actually start growing my hair back out for real I do not plan on 
putting any type of whitener or color or any harsh chemicals in my hair. I'm gonna just let it grow out like the Virgin Mary and I'm gonna let it do its thing. And I'm gonna take care of it, find me some products that's gonna work well for me and my hair growth journey and then that's gonna be that. But the lightening days and the coloring days will be over. That's when I decide to grow it back out, you know. Do I know when that's gonna be? No, I don't. Once I let it lighten this go around and then I'm gonna try a new color. I think after that, that's gonna be that. Cause I don't know if y'all noticed the pattern, but I lighten my hair and then eventually I put a color in it. That's been the pattern since I've cut my hair. That's what I'm gonna do. Just to let y'all know, I went in with, this is 20 volume, going in with this one first, and we gonna see how much it left from there. I went in with my, I use L'Oreal Quick Blue. Now, honestly, I don't be seeing a difference between like the Quick Blue and then the actual like Salon Care powder or the um, other ones. I haven't really noticed the difference between any of it. So at this point, just in case you wanted to know my recommendation, but if I'm really being honest, I think I just prefer Salon Care, all of it, just for the most part. I'm gonna go platinum one more time. And I have a color in mind, but I ain't gonna say too much yet, you know. I ain't gonna say too much. <sighs> all right, it is 12.30. It's 12.26, but whatever. Um, we round up. Um, so yeah, I'll check back in about 20 minutes. We gonna see, you know, the tips are already light cause I didn't cut it completely off. So all the color uh, didn't come out of my hair, but yeah, we just gonna see anyway. We gonna see how it go in about 20 minutes. Just thought I'd let y'all see that I did go ahead and lighten my brows. You know what I'm saying? I don't know why I didn't show that part. I apologize if anyone is angry at me. Okay, so this is how it's looking like I knew because I only went in with a 20, you know? But it's so even. That's what I really love. That it's just even all over, so. Mm. Yes. But I don't know if I want to go in today with the 40 or just give my hair some chance. Not some chance, Lord, but some room to just kind of breathe it out. But knowing me, I'll probably go in today because I'm ready to have this done and over with, honestly. So, yeah. How is how the curls are so cute. And that's... Still nice and healthy. That's what that 20 do. I might just go back in with the 20 again. Okay, so I'm about to go ahead and go in for a second round of lightener. It's been two days. So I gave my hair, you know, a little treatment. And other than that, I've just been letting my scalp breathe from the lightener. But we're going to go ahead and lift it some more. Y'all already know me, so... Yeah. All right. Got my handy dandy. Not gonna pull her or try and tug on her this time because last time it was a wreck. <laughs> I don't know if y'all can tell, but I put like some stuff on, um, like around the perimeter. Why am I chewing gum and filming? I'm not stopping. I hate to say that. Like I'm literally not. But I put some stuff around the perimeter of my head just to prevent it from like stinging and itching so much. 
going back in with our hands with it because we are ready to get this over with, aren't we? I'm going to lighten my brows again as well. But, um, yeah. How's everyone's new year going so far? So far, you know, I have been eating way better because they say, you know, it's 80% of what you eat and then 20% exercise. You know, you gotta start somewhere. So I've definitely been planning out my meals better. I've been meal prepping and that's something I'm proud of. It's been helping me like create my budgets, like going on the app first, like with HEB, I'll go on the app first and I'll make a list for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. I had plan, planned mine for the next three weeks. I'm right now I'm on my second week. You know what I should have did? I should have started a food diary. Okay, so I'm done. I, obviously, as you can see, that takes no time. That's the joy of like not having hair. Things take zero time to get done. So, I'm going to go ahead and do my brows some more. I don't know if I wanna do them at the same time because my head is already irritating the heck out of me. But, yeah, so as far as like New Year's goals, um, yeah, I just wanna make sure I'm, I'm taking better care of my body, really. Um, incorporating more movement throughout my day. Like I've been getting into yoga. I got into yoga a little bit last year. Um, and I would do it here and there. Ooh, shoot. Like it wouldn't be an everyday thing, but it would be a weekly thing. And I wanna make it an everyday thing. I love meditation. Meditation is something that I've gotten into. Like, I got into meditating in 2020. A meditation is a great practice. It's something that I'm happy I started um, to incorporate into my daily routine. Other than that, I want to, like, like I said, incorporate more movement. So I want to do more yoga. Um, and then I want to get into the gym. I'm not rushing myself though. Like I said, I have been eating better, doing better at planning out my meals. And I've been doing some research on different exercises though because I really want to do things that help me target specific areas of my body. And so there's this, I have to find her name and I'll probably put it on the screen, but there's this woman on on not on TikTok on YouTube that Jackie Ina um, spoke about and she does great indoor workouts and I did one of her hit workouts oh my gosh that thing right there had me in here about to pass out I'm not even gonna hold you but she does great great indoor exercises and I will put her name down just in case anybody want to check her out especially if you're not the going to the gym type and you prefer to do indoor workouts because that's how I am however there are only there's only so much you could do indoor indoors especially if you don't have a lot of equipment so and I don't have a lot of equipment which is why I want to start going to the gym um, but however indoor workouts are not bad at all like like I said she be getting it in okay um, so if you're an indoor workout type of person or not indoor, I should say at home workout. Like if you're an at home workout type of person, um, you should definitely check her out because I be in here like, what? I'm supposed to finish it? Like I started, but you want me to finish? Like, cause she be hitting it, but yeah. Other than that, um, just focus on me. You know, self-discipline equals self-love. So I really want to work on my discipline this year when it comes to just everything all across the board. You know, money, spending habits, good night. Spending habits, um, learning how to tell myself no when I know I should. 
um, just with anything, you know. So I'm the type, I do something productive and I'd be like, okay, we can watch like three YouTube videos and then we'll start back up with our productive day. Like I never have a full straight through productive day. I, I take so many breaks, so many breaks throughout my day, you know, when I'm being productive. You know, I'm just like, I'd be like, as long as I get everything done on my to-do list, it's fine. But I want to start doing better, you know? Okay, so I'm filming my outro on my phone because all of my memory cards are full. So, yeah, I just wanted to quickly show y'all my hair. You know what I'm saying? She's blonde. I just think that this is my era right now. This is what I'm feeling like the blonde. It's just for me but i got some new hair color y'all want to see okay yeah, I, yeah, I could show you okay. wait i don't want the towel in the bag but i got two colors so the blue is called sharp blue and then this one the green is called mint so i know for one I went up there with both of them, right? Because I just couldn't decide. And then the girl was like, ooh, are you going to, like, mix them, play with them in your hair? Like, do, like, partial one of one or something because they go so well together. And I'm like, that is so true. Those colors would look so beautiful together, but I don't know how to do them. I was just thinking I would do mint first, let that fade and do its thing, and then do the blue, you know, just swap it out. But I don't know. Either way, yeah. Your girl is just feeling a uh, short blondie right now. But other than that, I hope y'all enjoyed today's video. Please be sure to comment down below. Let me know what you would like to see from me on my channel. Give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel and then turn on your post notifications so you will be notified whenever I do upload. Thank y'all for watching and I'll see you all in my next one. Bye guys.